hello and welcome back to a foreigner and family farming in the Philippines and this is a update on the Del Monte situation here the rental contract that Del Monte had to rent this property to plant pineapples came to a close yesterday April 30th 2019 and as you can see, the property is still covered in pineapples. So we are going, there's all kinds of details with the contract and the, the people who sold us the property. Every, I mean, everything's squared away. There's, there's no reason for this. There was a, a clause in the contract where they could extended if both parties mutually consented we did not but we've got pineapple so we're going back to the attorney tomorrow and checking out just to see what our, our options here or, or if these are our pineapples if because the seller breached their contract with del monte perhaps del monte then didn't honor their clearing of the the pineapples in which case i might be stuck with a, a whole lot of pineapples some of these pineapples are looking close to being ready and i absolutely love pineapples pineapples are one of my favorite foods and i'm into the the fruits more so than the vegetables and i just love pineapples and i have not del monte if you're listening to this if it's, whatever happens with this I have not touched any of your pineapples as of yet, but if I can't wait to find out these are my pineapples and I can just start diving in because I absolutely love pineapples. But besides that, I need to see if I can find a market then to, to liquidate some of these pineapples because there are a ridiculous amount of them. I don't even know if I could get a crew large enough to just to, when they're ready, just to get them all sacked up before the before they go bad you know what the shelf life is and, and when I need to go ahead and start taking them if that's the case but that's why we're going back to the attorney tomorrow we're making sure everything's cleared up with Del Monte and then also continuing progress back on the, the property here we started to fence off the areas that were not rented by del, del monte and now we need to get back on that we need to just fence the whole whole property now just to just to secure it and we are we do plan on living here and just make it better for whatever we're growing not to have to have issues with with foot traffic and like the little all these little little roads in here were mainly for Del Monte, but uh, some some villagers have have used them as transport roads. But and, and the one the main one seems to go right through the middle of the property, right where we're putting our house, and that's just that that would be an issue. <laughs> so yeah, we're getting that cleared up and just getting it fenced off. And yeah, I don't want to give, I don't know what's going to happen with this and there's a lot of details with it. I'm not sure if I should be talking about it, so I'm just going to shut up. Keep it short, short little pineapple update. It's just frustrating here. The, the contract has finally come to a close and I'm, I am ready to, to get started here. But I've got a pineapple problem. That's it for now. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.